monostable shifter assembly R and R. Let us discuss the removal procedure. Using a 10 mm ring spanner, loosen and remove the battery negative terminal mounting nut. Remove the cover assembly console front LH. Using a star screwdriver, loosen and remove the console front and LH mounting screws. Remove the cover assembly console front RH. Using a star screwdriver, loosen and remove the console front and RH mounting screws. Using a star screwdriver, loosen and remove the console rear side mounting screws. Rotate and loosen the shift lever knob in anti-clockwise direction. Then remove the shift lever knob. Disconnect the power socket connector. Remove shift lever to front console mounting screws. Remove the floor console assembly separately. Disconnect the shift lever electrical connector from the shift lever assembly. Using a 12 mm socket spanner, loosen and remove the shifter mounting nuts at the front side. Using a 12 mm socket spanner, loosen and remove the shifter mounting bolts at the rear side. Remove the shifter assembly from the floor tunnel. Let us discuss the refit procedure. Refit shifter assembly to the floor tunnel. Refit the shifter mounting bolts at the rear side and torque tighten the mounting bolts to the specified value. Refit the shifter mounting nuts at the front side and torque tighten the mounting nuts to the specified value. Connect the shift lever electrical connector to the shift lever assembly. Refit the floor console assembly in the vehicle. Refit shift lever to the front console mounting screws. Connect the power socket connector. Place and tighten the lever knob by rotating it clockwise direction. Refit the floor console rear side mounting screws on the floor console mounting brackets. Refit the console front and mounting screws RH side. Refit the floor console RH side cover. Refit the console front and mounting screws LH side. Refit the floor console LH side cover. Connect the battery negative terminal mounting nut and torque tighten the nut to the specified value. Torque 2.5 Newton meter. Notice, wait for at least 30 seconds before switching on ignition and check the cluster if there is any malfunction light glowing.